Hi, my name's Nirav and I'm here today for the Kia EV5 media launch and drive experience in Australia. We've drove the car for several hundred kilometers and I think that after doing that, it's better value than the Hyundai Kona, which a lot of people will compare against when buying it. I was impressed with the air short range and long range during our media test drive south of Sydney along rough coast roads with lots of potholes. The ride and handling tuning Kia did for Australian conditions really shows. So when you first look at this Kia EV5 and you compare it to its sister car, the Hyundai Kona electric car, you might think, oh, they're pretty similar in price, so they must be the same value. But I'll explain why that's not the case. The first reason will appeal to fleet buyers and private personal buyers. The Kia EV5 is better value than the Hyundai Kona is usually here. If this wasn't such an immaculately cleaned press car, it would have a lovely Kia seven year warranty sticker on it. Now that's one of the longest warranties that, is, that are available for electric cars and means you get peace of mind for a much longer time compared to Hyundai's five year warranty. The second reason, which is a big difference between the Kia EV5 and its sister car, the Hyundai Kona is range in the base spec, especially with these two cars, the EV5 in the air base and the air extended range will go 10% further, which is a lot handier when you're driving around in the city. So you don't need to public charge as often. And also, especially on road trips, you don't need to stop at DC fast charges as often. One thing people ask me quite often is if you buy a Kia electric car like this Kia EV5, how long do you get Kia Connect app connectivity for remote control of heating, cooling, seeing your battery status? And how long do you get map updates for? That's a really good question. I'll show you how you can tell. Go to the menu, settings, click Kia Connect you'll see a date there. That should be seven years from the activation date when you first got your new Kia electric car. Why seven years, you say? Good question. It matches the warranty length. That is seven years from when the car was first activated at a Kia dealer and handed over. That means that you'll get map updates every six months as well for the full seven year warranty and you'll be able to use the app for the full seven year warranty at no extra charge that's pretty cool so what do you think if you're comparing the new kia ev5 to its sister the hyundai kona ev do you think the ev5 is a lot better like i do share your thoughts in the comments